Um, I stopped at the other uh, home site that we did last week. A uh, bunch, a bunch of turkey hunters in there. So I had to evade that place. Um, I didn't want to mess them up and I didn't want to lose that permission. They had permission before I did, you know, going in there and stuff. So, so today's about the only day that I had to, a full day to detect. So I came out to one of my giving home sites out here and uh, where I find uh, Civil War items and Colonial items. So uh, I've got a 77 in the hole here and I got to get it out before it fills up with water. And I figured we pull it out together. Yeah, I think I lost it now. There it is. Yeah, I hear you. All right. Let's see. Oh, we got a tomback button. Oh, there's mud. Yeah, you like it? I do. Looks like it's cut. Awesome, fine. Shut this thing up. Um, cool thing about this Tombak buttons. These are like, um, late 1700s, early 18, and I don't know if you know this or not, but one of the ingredients that's inside of this tomback button is a, is arsenic, so that's so cool. Pretty button. Alright guys, on to the next. Alright guys, next signal was a 62. I'd have dug this one live, but I had a 60 a few minutes ago, and it was a big piece of flat iron, and uh, you might see that at the end of the video, but I hit a 62, i say about a good 6 inches, 7 inches in the hole, I dug this piece. I don't know if that's going to be a um, like a suspender buckle or or what? It looks like it's got palm trees on it or something. That's pretty cool though. It's made out of tin. I like it. Alright guys, the next signal is a 58, and, uh, well, it's, yeah, it's 56, 58, and, uh, I'll bring you out on some of this iron I'm finding, you know, the big chunk of iron, but I think I know what it is. I believe that's going to be like a door plate to a house, maybe, where the lock is inside and stuff. I'll have 
have to clean it off when I take it home. Yeah, I think that's what's going to be a door lock. Or, yeah. But pretty cool, though. I like it. It goes with the, the property, so. <coughs> Alright, guys. On to the next. Since I talked to you last, I found some iron I haven't showed you. I'll go ahead and show you that quick. That way I ain't going to do a wrap up on all this iron and stuff later. But you've seen that. That's a tag or something. Then I found a wheel to something. Piece of iron. Another piece of iron. Another piece of iron. I don't show you that stuff digging it. I did find a little buckle though. But the camera was way up here and I was down in the bottom so I didn't bother getting it for this little buckle. Some nails, big nails, which sounded really good. Piece to a chain. Another big nail. And then I surface mine. Big old green mason jar bottom. 10A on the bottom. I like to find that hole in. And check, I want to just show you these handmade bricks out here for this old home site. Nine times out of ten, these bricks were made right here on this property. It's a pretty cool brick. There's probably enough bricks laying out here I can ship them all out of here and make a nice patio or something out of them. But yeah, it's a little too far to drag out of here. All right, guys. The next signal is a 58, and uh, well, it's yeah, 56, 58, and uh, I'll bring you out on some of this iron I'm finding. It was a big chunk of iron, but I think I know what it is. I believe that's going to be like a door plate to a house, maybe, where the lock is inside and stuff. I'll have to clean it off when I take it home. Yeah, I think that's what's going to be a door lock. Or, yeah pretty cool though I like it it goes with the the property so well, I had a 48 signal VDI numbers on the AT Pro and down here in this hole right here I see an edge of something square right there laying right up underneath this root so we're going to pull it out and we're going to see what this thing is together. Oh wow. I don't know, some kind of a tag maybe? It's got a hole right there. I don't know. I didn't bring a brush with me today, unfortunately. So we're going to have to wait till we get home. Looks like another hole over here and another one there maybe. Huh, that's a cool little piece though. Not sure what it is, but maybe it's got something on it once I clean it up and everything. If it does, I'll post another video or I'll add it to this one, the cleanup of it.